Hello everybody and welcome to today's No Money Spent episode and we have finally hit something good in the collector level. It's about damn time. We've hit 500 cards which has given us the Hall of Fame badge option pack. Haven't taken it yet so we're going to pick out which one we're going to get and uh, yeah I'm going to go through the collection, show you guys how it's, you know, how, how long it's taken me to get there, what you need to do to get to this point in the game. Uh, even though right now people are already at 600 cards I think. Uh, which is kind of crazy. Uh, I don't believe anybody has 650 at this point in time. I think 600 is the maximum. But we're now only 24 away from Pink Number Larry Johnson. So that's pretty cool, I guess. He'll be coming home in the not too distant future, which is nice. Uh, and as for this weekend, we still are unable to get ourselves our second trophy case player. Let me know down below in the comment section what are you. Uh, in terms of your next trophy case player, or maybe your first trophy case player. Have you got 14 out of 15? Are you looking for one more piece? Are you 13 out of 15? Because for me, it says 11, but I, I can get this top one and get these two on the right. That's easy. But this one in the bottom left, that's a random one. That could be in a historic pack. It could not be in a historic pack. It's a one in however many chance of getting it. A lot chance. One in 90 chance, I think, isn't it? Because there's three per team. I think, yeah, 30 teams, three per team. Yep, so one in 90 chance every time I open up a pack to get that one. Mm. I don't really like those odds, so I, I would be at 14 out of 15 for Big Z. And uh, we really did think going into today, the daily would be it. The daily is not it. It's 100 MT instead of a trophy case piece. So um, bit of a sad one uh, for, for today, but it is what it is. We've got a Hoff badge coming home, and I'm happy about that. So let's jump into it. If you're new to the channel, subscribe to the daily videos, and check out facebook.com slash crossover for the daily streams, including FIFA 23 streams and FIFA 23. Is goddamn awesome right about now. So, uh, with the weekend stuff, don't care about that. Dron Williams, nearly there. I've only got a day and uh, well, two days left, uh, but we only need 25 more threes, and we still need the 57 and the 7. So, yeah, ready to be straightforward. Dron Williams will be home in the not too distant future. Obviously, XP now, we don't need to worry about. I still need to do this one for a piece for Big Z, but the rest of the things down here, we don't really need to worry about that, which is very nice. Haven't done the challenge yet. Uh, because all we've really been doing, I, I wasn't really playing 2k at all yesterday, but um, you know, play a lock OP. 2k still haven't taken out of the game, um, and if they don't, then that's fine by me. Um, I don't have the time to sit through this game, and I also don't have the mental strength to sit through this game, because you guys know I'm really struggling with 2k23 this year, and I know a lot of other people are as well. Uh, but tomorrow, we will get the three Hoff badges from Unlimited, um, that's something. Uh, and then it's still another 3,500 points after that. The limitless 20 box. So in the not too distant future, we're gonna be getting there. Unlimited will be done, and then we can start to just I don't know. I don't even know what we do after that. If I'm very honest, trip the online we can do, and it shouldn't be too frustrating. Clutch time online do be frustrating. This game is not designed for 14 second shot clock, so not really liking clutch time online. If I'm honest. Uh, we are 46 and 16, which is not good either. I'm not good at this game. You guys know this. Uh, and we have completed limited. So, 100 tokens this weekend, which is decent. Next weekend, we're going to get 25,000 MT, which is very quite nice. You know, we're at 717k right now. Another 25,000 MT will not go amiss. And the team that we used for limited was a Jamarant starter card, Embiid starter card, Zach Levine, Kawhi, and Rudy Gay. And it took me, I want to say, six games. I think it was the sixth game. On the right, we had to play a full game, which took like 25, 30 minutes. But thankfully, at the end of it, we did get the ring. So, yeah, next few days, we'll get Unlimited done. And then I think we're just going to relax and play Triple Threat online. Do you want to get through Triple Threat offline as well? There's a long way to go there, though, isn't there? Oh, boy. There's a long way to go. And we've still got three games of Domination to play in the spotlight. And then actual Domination, we've still got... And this is why we're player locking, because there's just so much to do. It's ridiculous. And then over here, we need four more games to get the Domination Hoff Badge pack from there. And I think at this point in the year, we're just turning into Hoff Badge Hunters. That's all we are. We are just looking for Hoff Badges. Everywhere they are, I'm looking for them. So we've got one finishing, five shooting, one playmaking, and two defensive Hoff Badges. What is that? Three, four. We've got nine so far, which isn't too bad. Uh, but one thing I do have in store, uh, which I, I hope will be quite good... We are going to scoop up oh, 29k. You know what? I'm not mad at 29. You know what? I'm not mad at it. Scoop. And a scoop. And a little scoop. We sold our one that we pulled from Unlimited for 34k. So I'm not mad at picking these up. You can get half badges out of these. And I think we're going to risk it. And I think we'll do a video where we get five of these. And then, you know, the video will be like, I opened up five pink number prize balls and got 
whatever we get. But hopefully we can get some Hoff badges out of it. So here is our Hoff badge pack, 500 cards. What does a collection with 500 player cards look like? Now, again, just to say from last year, it's changed. This is just players. It's not jerseys, court floors, coaches, nothing like that. It's literally just players. So nothing from this down. Um, trophy case stuff, no, it doesn't count there. It's literally the season one and NBA series one. That's all your players. So Eastern Conference, completed it, mate. All done. And then the Western Conference, we are only, it was at four, eight, uh, 13 players away from completing the Western Conference, which is decent. And as for season one, so we've got nine reward cards. We have not got Spicy P, we have not got D'Angelo Russell, we have not got Kevin Love, and we have not got Jalen Brown, because expensive. Uh, takeover players, we've got Iggy, Donovan, and Elgin. We have not got Lamar Odom. We, did, we are going to get Deron Williams. We have not got Bill Russell, and we have not got Sean Camp. And then Season 1 players. So, these guys are still expensive, man. This, this dude's like 2k for a gold card. How about no? Uh, Ronnie Seekley is like 2k for a gold card. How about no? So series one selects or season one selects. This is a set for Jalen Brown. So we haven't really got many of those guys. We did lock in for Chris Mullin um, because I already had Boogie as untradeable, so I thought might as well. Kevin Love set. We've got eleven of those, missing the top ones, most expensive ones. Selects two. Just got Darrell Wright, uh, Darrell Wright, and Brevin Knight. Uh, Delos. We've got eleven and Spice Fees. We have got twelve because Buck. Oh, I thought he's untradeable. Uh, we, I think we packed, but yeah, we did pack Buck. Uh, so we got him there. And that's all I've got. And then we've got one Shades of Player, which is Paolo, because he's in my main team. And we've got one Paul Pierce, because he's in my main team. So that's what your account has to look like to be able to get 500 cards right now. To get higher than that, you have to own pretty much every single card in this game. You have to lock in JB. You have to lock in Mullen, Love. Uh, you have to lock in D'Lo. You have to lock in Spicy P. And are they, uh, you know, are they crazy expensive lock-ins? Oh, error code. Hello. Are they crazy expensive lock-ins? I mean, not really, but it looks a bit Mark Price ain't all that. Uh, Tony Allen, Mr. First Team All Defense, he's not uh, all that expensive either. So it won't cost you a lot to lock in. But it's all about the promo sets. And the cheapest promo cards you can get are like 10k. Uh, cheapest Intensity player, Zion, 10k. Cheapest Silencer player, the Amethyst MJ, 10k. Timeless, the Amethyst Jamal Crawford, maybe the cheapest, 10k. Every card is so expensive if they're in a promo because there's, there's only eight of them. And, uh, you know, so few people are opening up packs and the minimums in Amethyst. You know, the pack odds aren't great as ever. So, yeah, it's pretty hard to get higher than where we're at right now. I don't know if we're going to be able to get to Larry Johnson anytime soon. Uh, and then anywhere past that, it's not going to happen. So, uh, for now, I think we just got to enjoy this Hoff Badge Option Pack. So, I'm just going to get up where we can get some of these badges elsewhere. So, we've got Guard Up, Blinders, Dimer, Anchor, which I already have from the random badge pack from the exchange, which is a huge W, and Box Out Beast as well. Now, in Unlimited, Blinders is there, and we're gonna get three more chances at that um, Unlimited badge. Are there three other ones in Unlimited that I want to take? I don't really think so. Um, we've already taken Clamps, Quick First Step, and Agent 3. No, we didn't take Clamps. We took Agent 3, Quick First Step, and limitless range. So we're going to be taking clamps, probably posterizer, and we could take brick wall if we don't want to take blinders. But is guard up a good badge? Is dimer a good badge? Is box out beast a good badge? I don't really think so. So if we don't take blinders, even though if we do take blinders from here, then we can still take clamps, posterizer, and, and brick wall from unlimited. So you can get blinders elsewhere. You can get dimer elsewhere as well. We can get anchor from somewhere else as well, I believe. I think that's in Domination. Obviously, we've already got one. And the Box Out Beast and Guard Up, I don't think they're going to be that great about it. So it's got to be blinders. And we're already going for quite a lot of a shooting vibe uh, in terms of our Hoff badges. So blinders is here. Let's have a look. I believe we've got six now. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's quite nice. Blinders, Agent 3, and Limitless. And then Clutch, Volume, and Space. It's a pretty good shooting, a pretty good uh, look of badges, that. Can I search for Hoff badges? Can I just get my Hoff badges? Can I just get bad badges that are Hoff badges? Amethyst? Yeah, so we're up to double digits now. Not bad. It's taken us three weeks to get ten Hoff badges. I think that's pretty That's pretty decent. Um, we've got three to come tomorrow. 
Happy days. So we're going to be up to 13. We can get another one from the spotlights. That's 14. Triple threat offline is a 15. That is going to be 16. That's going to be 17. Um, Clutch time online gets another one. It's going to be 18. It's got to be more around the place somewhere. I'm sure there's, there's definitely more around the place. I think you can get 22 or 23 right now. Uh, there are more in domination. Uh, NBA champs gives you one. And then all time, I believe, gives you two, which is really quite nice. So we've just got to do so much playing of Domination. It's scary. Um, and I will get more time to do that when Unlimited is done. And the reason we are just pushing crazy to get this Unlimited done is because Pink Diamond Steph Curry is still over half a million MT. Because this auction house is just a mess, isn't it? Dominique's still 100k. Diamond Steph is still 150k. Diamond Zach Levine is still over 100k. We need that if we pull a pink diamond and it's Steph Curry, oh my god, we might be set for the goddamn year. We might even badge out Steph. If we pull Steph, we might even chuck a little little some of these on him. And we'll see what extra badge we pick up tomorrow. You know, we've got to pick up Clamps tomorrow. We'll have Clamps, Glove, Anchor for Steph. I mean, pff, we could maybe make quite a bit of empty already. So, um, yeah, tomorrow half badges in the next few days. Um, the limit is 20 box. I'm going to keep working in Domination. We're going to have this option pack soon and again in the next few days which is nice, and um, yeah, so far we just can't get ourselves another trophy case player, and it has now been over three weeks. Uh, we are over halfway into the first season, and there's still only been, if you weren't around with the two days of added into the token market, there's no way for you to have guaranteed yourself um, a, a single trophy case player, which is pretty damn wild. But there we go, everybody, that's going to do it from me today. We picked up these pink non prize balls, 30k. I mean, if we get a Hoff badge for 30k, I'm going to take that, you know, I think that's pretty good, uh, pretty good price. Any others on bids? No, nothing on bids, really. 31k, yeah. Yeah, nah. I did see one on open bid earlier, so for 35, so we'll, we'll skew that one for 31. So our MT's going to go down a little bit, but hopefully we'll just be adding in Hoff badges collections, so hopefully it won't be bad, but we'll pick up one more, and we'll open up five in total. So that's going to do it for me today, everybody. Hope you have enjoyed. As usual, please subscribe. I'll see you next time, and peace.